we're doing something called Skull Crushers. Okay, so it is about 2.15. Um, I got done with work and I just mailed out Bearcat Mermaid because Bearcat Mermaid can be mailed out with just a stamp. And I packaged up, I'm not showing you the side with the addresses on it, but packaged up my uh, Etsy order um, and that's getting mailed out today. Um, I'm getting my hair cut at 4 o'clock by my friend Julia. Um, it's, she needs like haircut models, so it's free, but I'm going to go to the ATM and take out some cash so I can leave her a tip and I'm going to mail this and maybe grab some food or something. Um, and then, yeah, so I kind of want to leave around three, three fifteen cause I'm going to get the light rail there. So, um, it's going to take a little bit longer. I'll have to do some walking and stuff like that. And I just want to make sure I get there in time. So I have about 45 minutes to run to the post office and the ATM, maybe grab some food. I just put my hair in a ponytail. I'm never really sure what to do with my hair when I go to the hairdressers. Like, my, you, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, should I wash it? Should I not wash it? Should I leave it as, as, as it is? So I just brushed it and put it in a ponytail, but it gets so tangled. I'm like, I'm sorry, Julia. <laughs> but I'm excited. I haven't had my hair cut since July 12th. Um, and I know that date because it was my birthday. So yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Just got to the post office. It's really windy outside today. It's kind of calm right now, but it was really windy earlier. There was like blowing over trash cans. And stuff. Anyway, hopefully it won't be too busy. Usually this post office is pretty fast, but I haven't been here in a while. Okay, so that was pretty fast. Um, and now in less than 10 minutes. Um, I'm going to miss that post office when I move. It was so fast. Always has been. I mean, I know it's the middle of the day on a Monday, but I mean, I don't think I've ever waited longer than 20 minutes there. Like in Fort Collins, you used to have to wait for like over an hour. It was ridiculous. Um, but that's mailed out. Got the receipt, got the tracking number. So I will send the buyer all of that info when I get back. Can't remember where I put my keys. They're in here somewhere. Anyway, now I have to go find an ATM. <laughs> The closest ATM to where I live is like really far away, so I'm actually gonna go into Target and see if they do cash back, cause I would rather just buy something, like buy a soda or something, than, um, or like get a, ooh, maybe I'll go to Starbucks and see if they do cash back at Starbucks, um, get a drink, than um, pay like a $3 ATM fee to use like a different ATM, so I think, I think that's my plan. Yay, Starbucks did cash back, so I got myself coffee. And, and then I also bought these. Oh, you can't really, hold on. Okay, so, sorry, I was like trying to juggle everything. I also got these cards. They say, seriously, thanks. They're from the Target Dollar section. I'm pretty sure I already have thank you cards, but I just wasn't 100% sure. Like, what if I got rid of them during the move or something, or I can't find them, and I just didn't feel like dealing with that. So I got those. So we are good to go. Okay, so I'm heading out to go get my hair cut. My phone is kind of low on battery, but I am bringing my charger. Um, I think I may get there a little bit early, but I figure I would just rather be early there earlier. I can sit in Union Station, charge my phone, and read my book than be there late, especially since, you know, I'm not actually paying to get my hair cut. I mean, I'm giving her a tip, but that's still way cheaper than it would be normally, so yeah. Um, I don't know how much I vlog because, like I said, my phone is dying. I'm in Union Station. It's 3.22, so I am quite early. And Julia just messaged me and said her client before me is running a little late. So she's running a little late, which is totally fine. So I'm going to go, I'm like going down the escalator right now and this like goes kind of underground and then comes back up in Union Station. So I'm gonna go find a place, buy a plug, and chill out for a little bit until it's time to get my hair cut. Kind of looks like a Friday, even though it's Monday.
No, it's not the short. It's just behind me. Okay, guys. So I just got my hair cut. Look how good this looks. Holy crap. My hair has not looked this healthy in so long. Um, my friend Julia did it at the parlor, I think it's called. Awesome. Um, super excited, actually. And she was telling me that on Mondays, because that's like their education day, they have like $12 color. And I was like, hmm, <laughs> sign me up for that. So I'm gonna have to go get that done again. And I think I'll probably get my hair cut one more time before I leave to the spring. Cause I was like, I need to get my hair cut more often because it looks so much better when it's cut more than seven months out of the year. Anyway, I'm gonna text Mandy. I'm gonna head back on the light rail, text Mandy. I think we might work out. I really wanna work out today. So I think she's gonna come show me how to use the gym in my apartment. <laughs> hey guys, so I haven't vlogged and I totally forgot and then I realized I should vlog before I go back to the gym. So <laughs> I'm going to the gym. Mandy came over, she's gonna help me wearing gym clothes and I went to go grab her headphones. I left her alone in there, but there's two dudes in there. So I might not vlog until they leave. And if they don't leave, then I will not vlog in there. But I'm gonna go work out. I'm at the gym. We're doing something called skull crushers. My arms really hurt. It hurts to hold the vlog camera up. Tomorrow all the vlogs are going to be like from here. Whatever, I'm working out. I think I skinned my elbow though because I dramatically fell off the bench. Um, so me and Mandy decided to explore my apartment building and like ride up and down the elevators like we used to do in college. And then I'm going to eat Indian food. <laughs> we did it because we were like, how many people? Probably. We just found this cool sitting area. The red floor also had a sitting area, but this is way cooler because look, there's like books and stuff, and there's this cool little like table, and this is a, a chessboard. <laughs> what? What? Oh my god, it's like 10 o'clock already. I don't even understand where the day has gone. Mandy just went home and I. Uh, <clears throat> Excuse me. I am just editing the video the vlog from yesterday um, And I think I want to make a plan of stuff to do tomorrow so that like I don't have to think about it, you know But anyway, I'm gonna go back to editing because I have quite a bit to do <laughs> It's already quite late Okay, so the vlog is edited and it is exporting so yay That is done. It is 1030. I am really tired I like, I really need to tidy, but I'm just gonna do it tomorrow. I'm like exhausted. I'm just waiting for that video to export so I can set it to upload and then I'm going straight to bed. So I'm gonna remember to say goodnight tonight and I'm gonna say thanks for watching and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye vlog! So I already said goodnight, but I bought a camera. <laughs> Um, it was just a cheap one. I've done a been redo I've been doing research over the past like three or four days and I was pretty sure this will work just fine. It's the where did it go? It's a Canon. Oh, my computer just throws up. Okay, so it is a Canon PowerShot SX610. So there is a newer version, but this was like thirty dollars cheaper. And I got it in white. All I really need is to film in 1080p and I'm really not that fussed about it. I was hoping I could get one with a flip out screen. This doesn't have a flip out screen. But actually that'll probably be good because I always look at myself when I'm filming and then I'm not actually looking at the camera. So yeah, if I, if I don't like it or I feel like the quality is not like better or anything like that, then I'm, I'll just return it. So yeah. Camera, yay!